well guys the new bed is here <laughs> we got no headboard no footboard no nothing boards but here it is this is the mattress we got the Sealy Poshtopedic Plus Hybrid on the Mattress Firm 9000 Power Base. And this is what the remote looks like for that. So it has lounge, incline, zero gravity. You get to program it. It has anti snore, um, wave mode. Massage, lumbar, head, foot. That's what it is, booze. That's what it is. So maybe we'll test this out a little later because I ain't got no sheets. I ain't got no sheets for this thing. Bright light, bright light, bright light. But y'all know the routine. Last night we went to Target. We eventually ended up at Target. We went to a bunch of different stores um, looking for just shopping for different furniture looks and stuff didn't buy anything but we did go to target where we needed some household stuff and of course sheets so that my dears came to 424 so guys last night was our first night sleeping on a bed oh i don't know i don't know i don't know it was not giving me all the comfort that i needed i kind of felt like i woke up and this part of my body was tense like my neck and shoulder area but i know that that probably can be fixed with a pillow i am ordering some new pillows um they're not in yet but i think that's what that is but i don't know we ordered the plush mattress type that that selection but why i feel like i need it to be more plush and i don't feel like i should have to buy a mattress topper to achieve that because this is a whole new bed but y'all know what they say. When you buy a new mattress, sometimes you have to sleep on it for some days or so um, to really get the true feel for your body to get acclimated. That's what they say. Do I truly believe that? kind of don't. And the reason why I kind of don't is because what about when I sleep at a hotel? That's my first night sleeping on that mattress. And I don't feel like I don't wake up with these aches and pains. I mean, at a good hotel, you know? So I don't know. If I do have to pay $300 to exchange that mattress, I will. Because I do think that getting it right is what's important. It's important to get it right. I love the base. Highly recommend. 10 out of 10. And the reason why I love the base is because I love that I can practically sit it up like an entire sofa. Come on, babies. Come back. I can practically sit it up like it's an entire love seat. And I love that. It, it, I, that feels good. I love the light feature, the little ambient light that you could get going on with that. But let me tell you, you know how you can buy those little light strips and it has the remote control? You can do that yourself. Tack that up under your bed and achieve that same look without having to buy a whole adjustable base. I also say that to say, if what's important to me on my, my base is the fact that I can sit it up and sit it back. Not necessarily, like I don't care about the feet going up or zero gravity and all of the other things. But if those things are important to me, then I feel like you can buy the simple adjustable base that just has the back part that goes up. And then you can tack on some light strings underneath. It has a little massage feature, but honestly, you can't feel that little rumbling thing. So it's like you turn a little massage on, really all you hear is like, it's going to be like some rumbling. But it's not really going to be doing anything for you, for real. The mattress, the jury's still out on that, y'all. The jury is still out. I want it to be softer. I, I think Jay said he felt fine. I think he said he slept okay. He, it was good for him. Good morning, guys. Today is Thursday, payday. Thursday, we got paid today. Guys, this bed. I ain't never. I hate this bed. Hate is such a strong word. Like, I toss and turn all night. And in the middle of my tossing and turns, I just want to punch this bed. And it's bed face. I do. Oh, my God. I hate this bed. Ooh. It seems like people either really love this bed or they hate it. I was reading reviews to see if I was the only one. Y'all, why my arm? My arm. It fell a freaking sleep last night. It fell asleep. 
because the bed is so freaking hard. My arm was like, why do you have me on this board? And then you're going to lay on top of me on top of that. Because I like to sleep on my side. The sheets kept popping up. This should probably be a whole bed review. But these sheets kept popping off the tops of the bed that might have something to do with the fact that the bed goes up and down but you know we pretty much have it in this position which is the um snore what is it called so the head of the bed is raised slightly it's the anti-snore position right here yeah um this is my second night sleeping on this bed this is my queen bedspread. I haven't even popped open the king. I mean, I'm going to have to do it because either way I go. They took my old bed. I wish I would have kept it. And um, whatever bed I get, it's going to be a king. But I need to wash that. So, and I ain't had time because I be coming home like 9 o'clock at night from work. But if this bed was a human, and I don't even be violent like that. But this bed sparks violence in me. I want to beat the bed up. I read in some of the reviews that some of the salespeople was telling their people um, to walk on the bed, to crawl on the bed. Maybe if you have kids, let them jump on the bed. I mean, the salesperson didn't say that. I'm saying that. But I say, that, but I'm like this, why do you have to do all of that to break a bed in? You get 120 days to test a bed. Why do I have to, like, at what point Will a bed truly be broken in? Like, does that take more than 120 days to do? Do we have to just get up here and rough play and rustle on this bed for it to be comfortable? Because a lot of people have said that the bed on the floor, the sales bed, feels so much softer than this bed. And it's so true. And perhaps it's because the sales bed on the floor is broken in. Maybe they have sale bed samples where they make sure that they're a little more extra than what they really are when you purchase the bed but I do not like this bed three thousand dollars don't like it I opened up this video but I think I'm gonna do a whole separate bed review because I don't like that bed don't like that bed and what I don't get is like maybe it is a broken in thing I don't know but like if I sleep in other beds and other homes I sleep. I actually can go to sleep. I could not sleep in this bed. Ugh, I don't like it. So we're leaning toward the bed going back. That's what it is. And then I'm talking to Jay because I said to him, remember yesterday he said he slept fine. And truly, every time I wake up all 50,000 times in the night, I look over, he's on his back looking like an angel, right? But I told him this morning, I said, yo, my arm fell asleep. Like it was tingling like... I need air. I can't breathe because I'm a slide side sleeper. And I said that to him and he goes, oh yeah, the same thing happened to me. If the same thing happened to you, why didn't you tell me that? Instead of saying that the, you, you slept fine. He was like, oh, cause I didn't know if it was just me. Cause I slept wrong. Mm -mm, no, it's the bed. It's the bed. Stay free. Okay. We still hate this bed. Look, it wake up looking like the projects. <laughs> Like, I ain't got no home training. All right, let me not say that. It wakes up. Wait. It wakes up looking like it ain't got no home training. What is this mess? Sheets all popped off. Not just the sheets. Not just the sheets. This is the sheets. And this is the mattress protector. Like, what the heck? What the heck? We tried sleeping last night with it in zero gravity mode. And I was like, this is some bull. Because zero gravity mode is mainly for sleeping on your back. And so then I put it back on snore mode, which means that the head is slightly elevated. But then I raised it a little bit more. This bed sucks. But the only other thing I really want to get done this week end is buy those mattresses and pillows. Yeah, I am so disappointed with this mattress purchase. I am so disappointed. Like, this is this is the worst. Ugh. Jay says, once again, he woke up this morning saying he slept like an angel or something like that. I don't know. Maybe it's when I looked at him. I looked at him like, boy, you sleeping like an angel. And I was just like, oh, this is the worst. I'm going to need to manifest a great mattress. I don't want good. I want a great mattress. I'm going to need my, I need my soul, my spirit to manifest a great mattress. Meaning that when we return that mattress, because it will be returned. Because I said, 
sometimes um depending on the housing situation my grandmother my mother and them be coming and we give them our bed i need my soul my soul is going to get this right because we deserve a great night's sleep and then the messed up part is like my old bed slept comfortable it was just small so i felt like um because it was a queen i felt like jay was always in my face breathing when we sleep and then um he would snore he says i snore too but i don't and the fact that it didn't sit up like when we watching tv that was the only thing but now that we have this bed he hasn't been snoring because i think we sleep with it on an incline and it raises. I love that about the, well, that's more the platform than the bed, but we just got to get this mattress situation right. And it's going to cost some, us some money to do that. Okay. Y'all. So it is Friday. I'm just leaving work. It's two 30. So I'm going to go stop by this mattress store and let them know how much I hate their mattress. <laughs> how much I hate the mattress I picked. Let's take some ownership. Um, I'm going to tell them I hate it. I'm also going to tell them how it feels and see if they can suggest a mattress based off of my symptoms. Is this the place? Yes. So that is my plan. I hope my sales guy is here because I do like him. But they might hear these complaints. Let's see. I know he is like, I am sick of her. I should have locked the door when I seen her. Her walk through. All right, guys. So uh, left the mattress store. So the thing about the mattress is, we can't exchange it for at least twenty days. And the website says like thirty days, but he said, you know, give him around twenty days, we could do something. So what I'm trying to figure out now, though, is even when I exchange it, what do I want to exchange it for? So I think next in this evolution, we're going to go to the purple store and try out purple mattresses um, because the purple store will have the variety of them and he can order it for me, but we're going to do that. But in the meantime, y'all, I'm washing this, this stuff, this linen that we just bought. And you dried it already? Yeah, but feel this part right here. It's hard? Yeah. Yeah, just like that one. What is that? Oh, yeah, it's, but you could tell it messed up. Oh, yeah, it toasted. It got stuck in there. Yeah, it's done. What do you mean it's done? We just bought this. It's done, bro. That's what you want to see. That's not done with your I'm so freaking confused. What happened? What happened? <sighs> I read it. It, it. it said tumble. It said tumble dry low. <laughs> but even then, that shouldn't have been. I feel like that was like that when I pulled it out the washing machine. But I didn't pay it no attention. You have got to be kidding me. And this is dry. Not, your black is not. New black is not supposed to feel like that. It's like it got burnt or something. Because look, put that down. Because at first I thought that was wet, but it's not. Oh my goodness, two hundred dollars. I think it was two hundred. It could have been more. I think it's about two hundred. Blanket out the window. That was the last one that we I'm so upset. Like this bed is a freaking like this. This is not working out. This bed is just trash. We buy these new sheets. They trash. These sheets cost one ten. They feel like the sixty five dollars sheets. They already told you you need special sheets for that. No, I mean these are deep pocket sheets, but yet they pop up. They don't even stay on the mattress. I'm just so annoyed. I'm just so annoyed. Life ain't supposed to be like this. I can't get you out of my mind. It's like I feel it for the first time. Thinking about you all night I've been searching for this all my life You're just my type I've been looking